So how are you doing guys? It's your boy Dave Partner. Um, what you have to know is that here, let's go to Bootstrap page and if you type on cart, we can get, if you type cart, cart, you see? Cart is under components. So if you go to components and, and click on cart, you can see the research for it here. So cart is a very interesting thing in Bootstrap 3. Look at, look at how it looks like. Compare this to what you have here. You see that it's almost the same thing. So that's what a card is. That's what we're gonna do um, in Bootstrap 3. So you take your time read through, read through cards. There is a lot on cards, a whole lot, a whole lot you can read about. It's much. So take your time and go through cards. Let me show you. In Bootstrap, this is a card, but if I hover my mouse here, uh, this other one is a card too. You see this guy that pops up beside this guy is a card too. That's it. Um, so take your time, go through, but I'll just copy code from here and then execute. Like I told you, I wouldn't, I will never waste your time on Bootstrap tutorial to type code uh, one by one. So these are huge cards if you want to uh, spread them out. So I'm just showing this is this, it's card that they used to do profile pictures. Look at this one pop up, nice cool pop looking pop up. Is it panels? So in Bootstrap 1, there used to be Bootstrap 3, for instance, there used to be panels, but they are gone now. We're now dealing with um, with cards, you see? Very nice cards. I'm just scrolling through so you see examples of what cards are. See these ones are joined together. See these ones, they are in groups. Exactly, look at what we're looking for. We're looking for cards that are spaced like this. Card that is need a set of equal width and height cards that aren't attached to, to one another. Use card that's cool. Look, look, at, look at what we're looking for. So we can copy it. Good. What's the difference in decks? We want to make sure I line up. Okay. This one has card footers. Let us see if there are footers here. I doubt. I don't think there are footers here. Don't need card footers. All right, so um, I'm gonna have to paste this. We go to index.html. Um, I need to make it smaller. So in index.html, we have to look for at the bottom here, under everything, we need to put it in a container too, all right? So we do a dot container, hit enter. Okay, cool. You know the reason why we need to put it in a container? Because if you look here, you see that it's it's in the middle. It, it's not touching the extreme. So we put it in a container. So we can control V. Oops. I'm always getting disappointed every time I think I copied something. So here, I have to control C, copy it. Uh, that is under if you're looking for it, it's under card decks. Then I'll control V. So it's just three. Remember that um, Bootstrap will continue to intelligently divide the, the screen and reduce the sizes as you go. So if we look at what we have here, let's refresh. Hello world, reload. Now we have this. Th it's three number. That's why it's this much, this huge. But these ones are one, two, three, four, five in number. So we're gonna go and add few extra. Um, before I do the few extra, I would like to I would like to add a realistic image. I would like to reduce it to one. Uh, well, before I do that, let me not jump any series. Let's multiply it to five first. So you see one two more that is making it five let us see if bootstrap will um, reduce the size reload you see bootstrap intelligently reduces the size in the next video i want to make sure that um i want to make sure that they are not touching and then i also want to make sure that we add an image in these all right see you guys in the next video